Hello everyone, and welcome back to 7 Days to Die version 1.0, build 336, hotfix version, on the PlayStation 5. So, a couple of days ago, after I had already recorded the last couple of days episodes, there was a hotfix update for console. And basically, it was uh, primarily some bug fixes designed for the Xbox Series consoles for stability, and I think some sort of save bug or something. So... <clears throat> Other than that, it was mostly just minor stuff. Important, but minor stuff. And, uh, some stability improvements, but again, supposedly most of those were for the Xbox version. But I'm sure we did get ourselves a few improvements. Yeah. So what we're going to do today is something that I've been wanting to do, and I'm not sure if I'm even going to really be able to ah, do it. And it's because you... Hmm. So I've been watching people that have been posting videos on version 1.0 about the Screamers. And I don't remember the name of the, of the person. He was like me. He was a small... He's a small YouTuber, so I don't remember the name. Sorry about that. Uh, anyway, he basically did a bunch of uh, tests about how far away a screamer can see you from, as well as what types of, what specific blocks can and can't be seen through by a screamer. Well, he basically determined that 15 blocks is the minimum number of blocks where they cannot see you or hear you if you're opening boxes or moving around. So what, we're, what I've been wanting to do is make basically a, a wall 15 blocks out from the edge of my, well, at least 15, which it's going to be 17 because I'm not going to count the two empty blocks here. And I wanted to make a solid wall all the way around with a way to get in. But I don't know if that's going to be a good idea because of, <clears throat> because of the horde base. Let, let's just see. That's one, we go two, three, five, six, seven... Yeah, I think that's probably fine. I don't think that'll be a problem at all. I mean, that's probably within 40 blocks. The zombies typically spawn <clears throat> around 40 blocks away from you. I think that's like the minimum. They can spawn more than that, but I think that's the minimum they have to be away to spawn. I don't think that's 40 blocks away. It looks like it's further, but you know what? I don't know. And I honestly don't care enough to actually test, or uh, what do you call it, measure. So, let's see just how big this wall would actually have to be, because, I mean, that's, that's massive. That's one. Seven, eight, nine. One, two. Righty. Why is there always stuff in my way, man? Go away. Likes you. No, I don't. I just can't even imagine. How big is this? Yes, that isn't. The amount of resources this is going to take. Wild. Even if I only made this two blocks tall, this is just going to be ungodly. Wow. It may not seem that big, but... Now, 
keep in mind when the guy said 15 blocks, I don't believe he was talking about 15 blocks like in an open field. He was talking about 15 blocks if they have no line of sight. So, yeah, I, you, I have to build something so they can't see me. So, for example, I think if I put a two-block high wall here, but then I stand up there at the edge and there's a screamer here, I think they might be able to see me. Not positive. It's been like a week or whatever since I watched that video, so I genuinely don't remember. Two. Why? I highly doubt I'm actually going to build this just because of the ridiculous amount of resource. But, just kind of want to see how big it would actually be. My god, this is... The base itself is like, what, 15 across or something like that? Well, I mean, if I was going to build in this entire 15, or inside this entire area, yeah, that definitely would be hard. But I do want to see just kind of how big this really is. I believe I've got enough resources. If I wanted to, I think I could do. Well, it's not small, but guys, how many re have? I know I've got a lot. Oh yeah, I think I could definitely, I could definitely do a two by two wall, two tall wall. And as you can see, I've got so much concrete uh, cement mix rather I can't even make it all I maybe I should make another I don't know I kind of want to do it a little bit of not as much as I'd like Oh god, and I've got another 400 here. Okay, I think we're probably... So, if I do build the wall like that, then I'm going to have to come up with a way on at least one side, if not two, probably on one on this side and on that side, get out. Hmm. I guess I could use Jewoodle's new... Uh, horse field thing, the... What was it? Uh, it was the six foot... It was the six block long ramp. I think, yeah, it's... Yeah, it's... I believe it's... This one. 
Yeah, it's definitely this one because that's too. Basically, this block, not on feet. Yeah, if you put it like this, wow, look at that. <laughs> too low, too low, and then high. Anyway, basically, if you build the, this particular block and you build it like this, as long as the zombie coming at you doesn't have to run more than, like, I don't know. He, he's, I, I watched the video a couple days ago, or whenever it was that came out. It was something like, I think it was 15 blocks, ironically enough. If the, uh, oh, I'm hungry again. I got good food. I can drink, too. Basically, if the zombie has to run longer than, like, 15 blocks to get around this, he's calling it the new zombie force field. Anyway... If uh, the zombie has to run more than, like, 15 blocks in either direction, or I should make... And at any rate, there is a limit to how far they will not jump over this. If they have to run too far, then they won't run around it. They'll just jump over it, meaning it's not actually a horse field at all. But, you know, whatever, that's neither here nor there. But you could use this in a short-range application, like I would be doing here. But I don't know if I want to do that. I think I'll probably just do the normal square walls. Although, now that I'm seeing this. Oh, did I get lucky? Oh my god, I totally got lucky. Yeah, I could build the wall here, obviously. It would be here. But if you go here... That means I would have to either build the wall one block taller here, or I'd have to dig out one block here. Of course, the wall would actually be at this block. So I guess technically I could get away with it. I don't know. I admit, I really want to do... I want to try it, is what I mean. I just don't know if I want to do it on, my le on this world, or if I want to do it on my private world. Test it out. See how well it works. I think that could be really, really interesting. Hmm. Unfortunately, this is the first episode I'm going to record in a small number of episodes, so I don't really want to, like, ask you guys what you think, because I could be done and dusted with this before you guys would ever even see this episode. Up. You know what? We're going to do it. We're just going to do it. Because I can. Okay. Mostly this is... I don't know. I guess I'd say this is probably more of a proof of concept more than it is anything else. I just want to know if this works. I mean, let's be fair. This is not... This isn't really something that's necessarily viable unless you're doing it in a relatively small... Oh, no, I'm going right. All right, let's go get this, and then we'll come back and we'll build the wall. Build the wall! Build the wall! If only walls would actually keep screamers out, we'll beat through it eventually good news is we can make it so that we'll give them a place to try to get in which will hopefully bring them to the entrance and then I can have them murdered by the um emo jobber <laughs> yeah stop snickering at me well I don't know if they're if the I don't know if this update did any uh made any actual difference in the performance, but I would say no. At least on PS5. Not that I really care, to be honest. Ooh. Forge ahead, some explosions. Alright. Old Deshong Tower right there. Alright, let's get back home. 
I heard gunshots. Oh, it's just... Now, that's weird, because I know in the version 1.1 experimental, they fixed the noises of the gunshots from uh, turrets making the... making that noise. That's fixed in the experimental, so I was... I'm surprised they didn't fix it in the hotfix for the console. See, consoles can't do the... Exp they can. They choose not to do the experimental builds on console. Likely because it costs money every time they release, re they release a patch. And, uh... Ooh, oh, analog drift. Stop that. Alright, so what do we get? We got some TAC Warfare. Okay, we can make a TAC Rifle 3. That's good. Sharpie sticks. Vehicle Adventures. 81... Oh... Sorry, my speaker was blocking part of my TV, and I couldn't see the numbers when I picked up the... Ooh, food. All right, so I think we're going to go ahead and do the wall. And we're just going to... We're just going to feel it out and see how it works. I am going to... Concrete, concrete. I am going to double check that it's 15. One, two, three. Five, six, seven, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. That means they will be on the sixteenth block on the outside, plus the extra two, that's seventeen. That should be sufficient. One, two, five, seven, no. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, fifteen. Yes. Okay. In two, four, five, thirteen, fifteen, four measured, one, two, three, yeah, here we go, one, two, five, and fifteen. Oh, yes. All right, let's get this wall built and see what happens. Nope, we are not going to dig a hole. No need. We're not going to be fighting zombies or anything like that. This is literally just to hold them at bay. Like I said, I could use the new blocks, which supposedly work pretty well. Maybe I, that's probably something I'll try on my private world. I haven't... Uh, I haven't been... I haven't been playing much the last couple of days. I've been playing Dragon Quest XI. I've been wanting to play it for many years. Oh, that wasn't... And, uh... Hey! Oh, wow. I call... shenanigans. I didn't hear no scream. God, I have to admit I love the haptic feedback thing on the PS5 controllers. I wasn't sold on it when they first announced it. At least I think it's called haptic feedback. It's when you use certain things like guns and it has like a... Re it, the, the trigger resists when you push on it. It only does it in this game for guns, but it's really freaking cool. Alright. Although, oddly enough, there was only one... Oh, 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 oh. Come on, back up, buddy. 
I'm gonna have to fill them holes in. Dang it. That's okay. I really they they look cool, the culvert things, but man, they're annoying as hell. Alright, so. Now the question is. It's it's there, it's just invisible. It'll become visible. That one's not. One, two, four, five. Okay. So this is where the entrance is going to be. So I got two choices. I can either put the drawbridge itself here, which means it'll extend out, I think it's seven blocks away. Five, six, seven. That means I'll have to dig out all of this so that when the drawbridge is up... No, I wouldn't have to dig it up at all. The drawbridge itself is the wall. I kind of would like to put, like, the wall here. Put the wall like this. One, four, five, six, seven. So the bridge would be here. And then I'd make these would be concrete blocks here. And then this, I would, ha I would obviously have the two bl block high walls here. And then the bridge would be here. And then this would, I would, I, yeah, I wouldn't dig it out. See, that wouldn't, I don't know, would it look better that way? Or would it be better to have the bridge here and then actually, when it when it goes down, it'll stick out of the base? I kind of like the idea of having the bridge here and then when it, when it opens, then... Hmm. You know what? The nice thing about this is that is not something I need to decide right now. A butthole. That's okay. I still love you. Not really. You. <laughs> My main concern. I mean, I, I, the idea is that you want them to run around, so they come to the front, where I'm going to have the uh, turret set up. But the problem with that is they won't. If they come from that side, they, there's no way they're going to run all the way around to come here. But that's why I'm going to put a second exit. But then if they come over here, would they run? I think they will. It's probably going to be at the absolute limit of their pathing. But I think as long as I put an entrance or an exit, whatever, on both sides opposite... Then they theoretically, theory, they should be able to, the pathing will be really close, but I think they will not try to just beat through the wall. I think they will try to come to wherever I have an easier path to get into. That's the hope. Again, that we're going to find out. Now, I also need to remember to do that. I don't know. Do I? I do that. There's, I mean, the 4x4 four four is so big. Driving it around the base on the inside of this, I don't know, the courtyard or whatever you want to call it, probably would be fine. But I'm definitely going to want to do... What I'm, what I'm, what I'm thinking here is... I want to keep it centered with the building, right? But there's not going to be a door on this side. So if I put it in the center, that means I'm always going to have to drive, you know, all the way around the building. I think that's fine. I don't think that'll be an issue. But I do believe I want to also... I do want to center the other exit with the building. There's the center. Okay. Do, 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 do. Uh, yes. That and 
this. That is the actual. That's where the door is going to go. Of course, that does also mean I need another um, turret, because I believe I only have one. Not a problem. Turrets are easy to hit. Not difficult at all. Little bit of money, but since we now have the little, uh, I don't even know if honestly I'd call it an exploit to be fair. The, um, making the mini bike handlebars. Obviously, some people are going to call it an exploit. But, uh, the thing about it is, while, yeah, it's true you can make them, there is one limiting factor that you can't get around, and that is the headlights. You need one headlight for each one you make, and headlights cannot be crafted or bought. They can only be gotten from wrenching vehicles, and they aren't exactly a high drop rate. So, yes, it is, it, it, it's definitely, I don't know, I, I don't know if I'd say it's an exploit, but I guess maybe it is. But since you are rather seriously limited, I don't really see it, I don't mind using it, although I don't use it that much. I've used it a couple times already in this series, and I two or, once or twice at least. No, I didn't mean to put... Well, you know what? That's fine. Maybe we'll do three blocks. For now, I just want two because two is the minimum that they can't uh, jump over. I can always make it taller. Maybe I'll add a, um, a fence or something goofy on top, you know, for looks. Let's get this done. I know today's not going to be the most exciting episode, but... Honestly, I actually really enjoy building episodes, but that's me. Realized I didn't build. Oh, there we go. Uh, let's see. In four. Aubrey. Yeah, I still think it's weird that they changed it. I think it was an Alpha 21. You used to need 2,000 wood. Now you need 20. You also need to use, I think it was like 100 iron. I don't know. What I'm gonna do. It just seems weird to me that they... I can understand reducing the wood and the iron requirements a bit, but to reduce it by, what was it, like 1% or 2% of what it originally was? I forget. Oh, I grabbed pipes. Pipes. That makes sense. I'm gonna need two of those. Can I? I don't think I can make. Uh, I don't think I can make powered ones yet. Can? No evil. Oh god, I'm a long way from powered ones. Okay, never mind. I'll have to dig all this out. Yada yada yada. But for now. Not realize that I had not even. Oh, okay. Never mind. That's okay. Ooh. Wow, I gotta admit, I thought I'd use up. Way more than one full stack. Even with like 50 I just picked up from the thing. I'm not even close to one full stack being. But I use probably around 300 or so. Not bad at all, honestly. Not too shabby. That. Now for the... Oh, what I need to do? Those placed back out here. Yeah. You're outside the walls, aren't you? I want to get these back out. Oh, you know what? Give me that. I'm looking around, and obviously, if they're on the other side of the wall, they can't climb over. That was a crawler. Oh, oh no, it wasn't. 
Oh, oh, it was way more than one. Get off my truck. I like my truck. Don't want you anywhere near it. Get up. Hey! Why do zombies like my truck so much? They like my vehicle. Doesn't matter what it is. I think I just saw a gun. I did see a gun. Oh, God. Whoops. Okay. Get. Nice. More attack warfares. Alright. There's those. Hope yeah, those should be okay out of the way. Those no. I do need double. Sneak. Crap away. Double. Yes. I guess I should probably have. Oh well. I can always. I'm gonna dig all this out here in the inside and replace it later anyway. I can always do then put a layer of stone concrete underneath. I'm just doing that right now for the all this out. enough. Fortunately, this out here is not enough. sooner. There it is. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna have to dig a bunch of this out. Crap. It's a lot, but, you know, what are you gonna do? Must be done. Four by four is tall, but... I'll level all this stuff out completely off camera and stuff. For now, I just kind of want to get the basic part down. I want to be able to drive in and out. Without too much headache. I can always put minor ramp blocks, that kind of stuff, in later. Make this all nice and even, but for now... what I wanted. Alright. Gonna have to chop these out and then put some dirt in there, but for now... A little bit of a tight fit, but it works. There's that.
going to be like that. I, I've never understood why this is so finicky. Sometimes it goes in just fine, other times not so much. Like we got it in just right. And of course you can still double click so it opens and closes quickly. There we go. Now I just got to build the really up over the top of that. Get our Okay, we are... That was up, right? Yep, we're technically safe now. Nothing can get to us. Let's get... Firing. Could be all we need. Hey, hey! All nice and... Oh, okay. Give me this and my stuff. Wink. Let's... Okay, and then of course we... I think we can probably... There it is. We go face there, then copy rotation. That and it looks like it's gonna be a butthole. It's fine. It blows over me. Rotation. Cooperate. There we go. Need. It's time to put your chairs in the wagon. We are closing soon. We are closing soon. There's that, and then of course I forgot to grab this. Wink. heard a scream. For some reason, I forgot that I didn't need this anymore. That's for the uh, electric fence. Or not you. But I know I just heard a scream. But it was far away. So I'm going to assume. Probably beat on the one back. Definitely wasn't beaten on this one. Well, you know what? I really don't care. Yeah, there she is again. I heard her again. She must be way out there somewhere. You know what? It doesn't matter. I've got the, uh...
There you go. One completed entrance. Alright, this episode is holy crap 40 minutes. Alright, so that's going to be it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, feel free to leave a like or subscribe. And of course, as always, I will see you all in the next video. Have a great day, everyone.